Okay. Pushing the envelope of English propriety, political correctness, manners, taste, and all that's held holy on their groundbreaking TV show, along with Monty Python albums, live performances, and feature films from the Holy Grail. But she's a witch. Well, she turned me into a newt. A newt. We got better. To the controversial life of Brian. Always look on the bright side of life. Now, though, they're preparing to bring down the curtain and that famous foot forever. I think the one on the 20th really is the last show, yeah. and I think we all feel very content with that now. Earlier this morning at a press conference, the five surviving pythons, Michael Palin, Eric Idle, Terry Gilliam, Terry Jones, and John Cleese, original member Graham Chapman died in 1989, talked about their final reunion, a run of ten live shows in London that begins on Tuesday. I think it's much better to try and do it once really well in England where it started and just leave it at that. The question was how to fill that arena. We wanted to give them something a bit more. We did want to come add a lot of stuff and make it a big show. After all these years, the wit and comedic chemistry of Monty Python still delight their multiple generation of fans and the guys themselves. And we're enjoying it like we did 40, 50 years ago. For Good Morning America, Chris Connolly, ABC News, Los Angeles. I can't wait. They look great. Great to have them back. And Ginger's back now with...